Hello Vikings and welcome back to another Assassin's Creed Valhalla video. So, for Koden Saga it is really close, as PlayStation Game Sizes did read out that update 1.6.0 it is coming, we have new trophies, if you want to see every trophy that we are gonna get, well, I will leave my video on that one in the pinned comment and also in the description box down below, so be sure to check them out. So, free game mode, as we all know, it is gonna be the Forgotten Saga roguelite game mode that is coming really soon, but without further talking, let's roll Ubisoft Game Plan's official trailer about the tips that you actually need to know before you are starting your journey into the Niflheim. So, huge shout out to Ubisoft Game Plan, their channel link will be in the description box down below, so be sure to check them out. But now, let's dive into the tips and again, huge shout out to Ubisoft Game Plan channel. Dive deep into Niflheim and take on the epic challenge of our new free game mode, Assassin's Creed Valhalla Forgotten Saga. Odin returns in this roguelite inspired experience in a quest to five fate and overcome hell. To prepare you for the challenges ahead, we have five things you need to know before playing Forgotten Saga. As the roguelite inspired mode is a first for AC, we're going to cover everything you'll need to make the most out of each run. As you descend through the four regions of Niflheim, you'll be faced with seemingly insurmountable challenges, but rest assured, hidden throughout the world are secrets that will improve your chances of survival. Each battle will make you stronger, but to make the most out of your time in Forgotten Saga, keep a keen eye out for the secret areas during your journey. You can find hidden buffs throughout the regions that, once you've managed to defeat the enemy guarding it, will grant Odin permanent upgrades that persist for each run. As well, you can find secret merchants that will allow you to trade coins gathered from your run for new gear, runes, upgrades, and abilities. And remember to explore your surroundings. You might just find the upgrades you need. Your gear plays an important role in Forgotten Saga as you won't have access to the armor you've collected throughout your journey across England. Once you enter the realm of Niflheim, you will need to rely on what you find to progress. Each gear set you unlock is equipped with specific perks that cater to a variety of playstyles. Some gear will lean more towards a stealth approach, while others will make you deadly at range. Selecting the gear set that fits your strengths will play a huge part in your success. If you haven't found the gear that fits you, keep pushing further in your runs, explore secret areas, or check with merchants. While your weapons are completely randomized for each attempt, your gear set will always remain, so test out different compositions until you find what works for you. There are many paths to success in Forgotten Saga, and it will be up to you to make lasting choices that will decide the route each run will take. With branching traversal options and no backtracking between areas, you will need to think carefully about how to increase your odds of making it to the end. Do you push straight to the next area, or perhaps take a detour to face some more enemies and risk losing some health to break open a lockbox? Branching paths aren't the only decisions you will make. Ahead of each run, you will have to confirm your gear, choose your favors, and commit to the approach for the next attempt. And when it comes to offensive options, picking up a new weapon mid-run will destroy the one you currently have, so make sure you are certain it's a worthy trade before you start replacing weapons. You will live, and more than likely, die, based on these decisions. So always keep experimenting and don't be afraid to take risks because... Dying is a normal part of your journey through Niflheim. Enemies are tough, bosses are relentless, and sometimes you're just going to make a bad decision. That's okay. Death is an important opportunity to refresh your approach, change or upgrade your gear, and ultimately to continue to get better. Any skills you unlock while in the hub will persist even after death, so each run will allow you to push further and further into the four regions. But there are larger implications to death in this new mode. With each death, you may encounter familiar faces who have come to confront Odin about his foolish conquest. Do not fear the idea of dying mid-run. It will only make you stronger and better positioned to emerge triumphant next time. Odin's journey in Forgotten Saga will see him encounter a variety of mysterious figures in Niflheim that, if you assist them, can provide amazing rewards. 
Keep in mind though, some of these side quests cannot be completed in a single run, so be sure to develop a keen strategy to maximize the time you spend in each region. Coordinating your efforts is going to be the key to optimizing each run and unlocking all the seekers this mode has to offer. You are nothing if not persistent, Javi. Overcoming hell and the dangerous enemies of Niflheim won't be an easy task, but we hope that these tips will be helpful in getting you started. Remember, before you can access this new free game mode, you will have had to reach the realm of Asgard during the main campaign. So if you have, sharpen your axes, select your gear, and get ready to take on the colossal foes in Assassin's Creed Valhalla Forgotten Saga. Again, huge shout out and huge thank you, Ubisoft Game Plan, for making this guide and clearing so many things that I really think many of us were wondering what will come, what it will be like. So thank you, that was really clear explanation what is waiting for us in Niflheim and Vikings, Silk Maidens. Hopefully I will see you there, I will be live streaming that when it hits live, so be sure to turn on the notifications on so you won't miss anything. And of course I try to make guides and tips what you can use, but for now, huge shout out to Elite Wolfpack aka the members of the channel, but for now, let's roll the outro. Thanks for watching, remember to hit the like, hit the sub, turn on the notifications so you won't ever miss anything that I upload or when I go live. Also Vikings. Have fun, stay safe, be strong, hope to see you in the next one. Skatha, over and up, and bye bye.